Police brutality, rioting public, tensions between civilians and police have never been higher. Our own Boris Hyken thinks that he can help resolve those tensions in a new segment we call Boris on Your Side. Matt, I know no one's expecting to hear this from a reporter, but I've got this thing solved. It's called charging cops a buck or two extra. They're charging them a buck or two extra for what? For whatever. Coffee, cigarettes, Six Flags passes. Boris, I failed to see the connection. I'm gonna hit the streets and see if I can get the people on board, Matt. Yeah. Cool. What do you think about charging cops a buck or two extra? What do you mean by charging them? For instance, if they go to a cafe or they go to buy something, charge them a buck or two extra. For what? Well, you know, police are sometimes out of line and they do criminal acts. And so now we charge them a buck or two extra. But now you're penalizing an entire workforce based on X percentage of people that do criminal acts, right? I'm not sure that I like draw any sort of connection between like police brutality and the amount they pay for coffee. People were skeptical. Even business owners were dubious. But soon enough, they began to see the wisdom of my idea. So you've heard of maybe a better solution than this? No. Are you aware of any initiatives currently being taken to deal with this issue and try to mend that rift aside from the one that I'm proposing? None at all, no. So this is the best we have, really? In theory, yeah, it would be. <laughs> Cops were reluctant to hear me out, so I ran my idea by a couple of political analysts. For all cops? For any cop? If you can tell they're a cop, yeah, if they're in uniform, I guess. I'm not a lawyer, so, but it, to me it sounds illegal. Obviously, you know, new ideas cause ripples. Uh, Galileo was persecuted by the church. Well, I don't think that this idea is as, as revolutionary as Galileo's idea. And I think that the best way to hold people accountable is through trials and, and, and the court of law and the justice system. Just so it's clear, we're just talking about a buck or two here. Right. They're not going with pitchforks and broomsticks right. after these right. police officers. Right, well, it starts at a buck or two, but, you know, if they feel they should up the ante, I Maybe mean... Maybe bring it to four or five bucks if the police aren't doing a better yeah, job. I mean, Ryan made a good point. Mo money, less cop problems. But before upping the ante, I figured I'd get a liberal's approval. Those guys hate cops. It's a bad idea. It's, it's logically flawed. And by flawed, I mean, like, there's no grounding to it whatsoever. You're saying that it doesn't make sense to charge cops a buck or two extra. It does not. What if it was three or four bucks extra? Just because you're raising the amount of money doesn't mean that it's changing the fact that the plan won't work. So you're saying there's really not that much we could do as far as crooked cops go? Well, if Batman were real, that'd be different. Because Batman could handle all of this. Batman could force cops to pay a buck or two extra. Crooked cops, like in Batman, Batman beats up crooked cops because he's Batman. I just want to remind you of something. Yes. The city of Gotham in the Batman world is a cesspool of crime. Yes. There's something very specific, if you remember, about the city of Gotham. They don't charge cops a buck or two extra. This is very true. So charging a buck or two extra is sort of our Batman. Um... Matt, it's too early to call myself a hero, but the movement is catching. It's not perfect. It may not be enough. Perhaps it'll take five or six bucks to fix this rift. Thank you, Boris. We completely agree that you're not a hero. It's whatever time you're watching this, and our news is your news. Hi, I'm Eric, and this is Phoebe. We're members of UCB1. Thanks for watching our video. Yeah, if you want to see more UCB1 videos, click on us. Yeah, click right here. It's my favorite clicking spot. Mm. And if you want to subscribe, click right over here. If you want to see more UCB comedy videos in general, click down there. You got it. You got it. <laughs>